Hey, it's Jonathan with Service Autopilot. I'm with a, here with a friend of mine, Dean Jackson. We're in Florida. And Dean's really, he's a genius behind so many businesses and some of the biggest marketing names out there. And uh, I've learned for years now so many things from Dean. And so we've had the opportunity to come to Florida and, and spend three days with him. And so Dean, I don't know that most people know you because right. you're behind the success right. of so many people and <laughs> right. you're, uh, you're yeah. not out there gloating in any way. So right, exactly. can you tell... Uh, everybody a sure. little bit about you? Um, yeah, so I have a story on me. I started out as a real estate agent, started learning marketing and applying it to my own business, and then started licensing all the things that I was doing to other realtors. So I learned how to kind of package the things that I was doing as turnkey solutions for other realtors. So for you know 20 years now, I've been out uh, helping real estate agents make more money. And then teamed up with my, my friend Joe Polish, who I've known for 15 years, who was doing the same thing I was doing for carpet cleaners. And how we realized, boy, we've learned a lot of lessons along the way that not only apply to carpet cleaning and to real estate, but apply to all businesses. So we started the I Love Marketing podcast, and, and we share all of those kind of things um, with all kinds of business owners all over the world. Right. And if you're not watching I Love Marketing, Dot com, you really need to check it out. It's an incredible marketing education that you'd normally pay an incredible amount of money to get. So you've got to be paying attention to that. Right. You guys have done a great job Thanks. there. Thanks. So because you're behind so many businesses and you've mm -hmm. seen so many successes, can you tell me a little bit about if there's one big difference maker between the guys that are really doing well, making money, mm -hmm. successful in their business, actually creating a good lifestyle, right. what's that big difference maker that really is different about those sure. kind of guys? Um, the difference, I would say, in my observation between all the businesses that are really thriving are ones that provide, you know, transformational change for businesses. Businesses that, that when they apply their, um, their product or their, their ideas that they're getting incredible results. So that it all starts with a result focus. Right. And because they've got that result focus, you can make it super easy for people to to get started if you can be in a position where you can get somebody results ahead of time and they can pay from the results that they're going to create that's like the rocket fuel that can really help a business grow so no matter what even if they're charging up front being able to get that result gives you that confidence that's fantastic yeah so one topic that I really love is direct mail I mm -hmm. like direct mail so many Me guys too. are they, they've tried it once and they don't think it works or they write it off in their business, they write it off in their industry. Yeah. And you're awesome at direct mail. You're I awesome at creating mail. a funnel to bring mm -hmm. people in and, and take them from offline and bring them online. Right. So for all the guys out there that tried direct mail, had a bad experience and just don't think it's going to work for them, right. is there a piece of wisdom you can give them to yeah. get them back in the game? Yeah. I mean, you know, one of the things, that we, and we talked about this over the three days, yeah. that the very first step has to be to just get somebody to raise their hand that they're interested. I mean, I think it's very valuable to know that offering somebody something that just has complete self-interest on their part, mm -hmm. driving it, that's compelling for people. And I, you know, one of the things I, one of the distinctions I make is looking um, for creating a compelling offer more than a convincing argument mm -hmm. because some yeah. when somebody is compelled to do something it's driven by their own self-interest right. and that's like getting into the jet stream you know just like moving uh, at light speed you can get uh, they're already in motion moving towards what they want that's so great yeah that's great Dean, it's been great hanging out with you awesome, for three man. days. Had Thanks. a great time with you. Thank You've you got too. to check out Dean on I Love Marketing. Incredible wisdom. Pay attention to him. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, guys.